Hey guys, Whistler's Campground, I have to say, is probably one of my new favorites. What do you think, babe? Yeah, I agree. Yeah, I we agree. thought Banff was our best, and now that we've been at Whistler's, I think Whistler's might be our favorite, even though Banff is Banff, 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 <laughs> however you say it, Banff is equally awesome. Bananf? Bananf. Bananfa? No, it's Banff. You had Banff. it right. It's Banff. So yeah, we like it because big spot, full yeah. hookup. We kind of have a fire. But um, they do have a fire ban here because of all the Alberta and Western Canadian Rocky fires. So our little pile here, we stacked it, unstacked it, brought it back. The gate was closed, brought it back here. Yeah. And unstacked it again. Because so. I told the ranger I would take it back myself. And then when she handed me the fire ban pamphlet, I didn't realize they were locking the fire section, like the wood. <laughs> so when we went to take the wood back, it's locked, so yeah. we can't. So now they have to clean up our mess. I apologize to the park rangers at Jasper. And there's plenty of places to walk through here. I miles, the trails. I would say miles of trails. Oh my goodness, I know. Now we're spanning for you. Lots of people. Beautiful Lots view. Of places. Yeah. We miss everybody. For sure. Hi guys, we're in Jasper National Park. Here's the thing about Jasper. I always throw my trash out right before I walk outside. Stop eating charcoal, mama. Come here, what, what is it about charcoal? Anyway, dog's constantly eating charcoal. Come here. Anyway, I threw my trash outside and then I was getting my shoes off to come out right away. Bad choice. By the time I got outside, there's a raven that pecked a hole in my trash and started eating my avocado peels. So now I gotta go with my vinegar and water and clean it up real good so that the bears don't come. I don't know, are bears attracted to vinegar and water? I hope not. I know Mallory loves vinegar. She'll lick it off of anything, including the cabinets and the windows. Charcoal vinegar leather dog. <laughs> This is one of the elk that live in Jasper National Park. And we were actually told <laughs> to stay away from them because the mamas are having their babies and they're super protective. And so in the book, it said that there's more injuries on humans from elk than any other animal in this area. So someone forgot to tell the elk that because we're always trying to cross the road away from the herd. And then the herd is like crossing the road right in front of us. They just don't care. Like, they just get right next to you when you're trying to get away from them. It's very interesting. Mallory and I are hiking to the Valley of the Five Lakes. Now relax. Mama's getting a video. You hear those squirrels? <sighs> that chirping, you would think. 
they're birds, but they're not. There's those little ground squirrels. And when you look at them, you can see their little tummies inflate and deflate. It's pretty cute. Anyway, I'm going to give you an update on the truck and the camper because last time we were talking about how our freshwater tank sprang a leak and then right when we started the truck, it had a check engine light. Well, let me tell you what. I prayed over the truck and asked Jesus to please make the engine light go off and heal the truck and guess what? It went off and healed the truck. So we have an appointment to get the fresh water tank looked at on the RV, but it's gonna take over a month. Some places said November. So everybody's getting their campers out of uh, being winterized right now. So mid-June is our appointment. Hopefully we don't have mold or anything like that under our underbelly and, and it's all good. I'm not gonna worry about it. Can't control it. There's bumps in the road in life. You just, you just gotta roll with it. So that's what we're doing. We're rolling with it. And we leave here, we leave Jasper tomorrow to start heading up north. And after our next spot, we get on the Alcan, the Alaska Canada Highway. So I'm super excited, excited for the drives. Um, trying to avoid the wildfires here. There's a lot of wildfires raging, especially in Alberta. So we've been keeping track of that and I called the rangers today just to make sure that we weren't gonna run into any road closures from the wildfires or God forbid a wildfire. So they said everything looks good. We'll check again tomorrow morning and as we drive through uh, the mountains here, but so far it's good. And it's about 60 degrees right now. And as you can see, I took off my jacket and my long sleeve shirt and it's, um, it's beautiful. 60 degrees here feels a lot different than it does at a lower altitude. hiking trails here at Whistler's Campground. So they're just hiking trails throughout the park, which is good, honestly, because they have so much camping here and they're in little circles and it's easy to get into a circle. And then there's really no way to get out unless you walk all the way around the circle and go to the main road. So they put these hiking trails in so that you could hike in between the circles. That's great. And then they have this little log cabin which I think is like a little playhouse for kids, but it's fun. <laughs> Mallory loves these trails, but she keeps trying to hunt, you know, which is unfortunate because she pulls when she tries to hunt. <sighs> she hasn't eaten a raisin yet, though, or a ground squirrel, so I think we're good. 